For the owlbear, you can turn around the neck piece so it can look down more, have the painted part of it on the chest. Turns out that is very, very true. Out of the package, in order to look forward in the standing position, you have to crunch the legs, very hunched down, and then it's looking forward. You'll also notice that the painted part of the neck drifts away from the painted part of the back. While on the front, there's paint on the chest, but bringing the head forward brings this unpainted part here. The first time I tried this, I was like, nuh -uh, it won't turn. Pops away from the peg and you're left with a gap. It almost seems like this was designed that way on purpose because there's not a big mushroom there. I'd almost say it's supposed to pop off. Rotate around the head and you get a much nicer head forward position kind of fierce. And with that, the painted part of the neck is up here with the painted part of the chest, and the unpainted part of the neck is back here with the unpainted part of the torso. You do get more down movement if you rotate that neck piece. 